I started playing the cello when I was seven, so I've been playing for seven years. Um, my mom emailed me this link to a competition called the American Protégé Piano and String Competition, and I thought it was a pretty cool idea to apply, so we recorded a couple of pieces and video, sent in a couple of essays, and I won. So I got to play at Carnegie Hall in 2012, and then the next year I was still looking for some stuff to do with my cello. So I applied again with a different age group though, and I won again. I definitely wasn't very confident that I would win the competition. I kind of just sent in an application to send it in and try it. So it was a really nice surprise that I won. Well, when I'm performing, I try to approach it by not seeing it as such a big deal. But, oh, this isn't really that different from a normal performance. It's just in a nicer place, obviously, with better acoustics. So. With every performance, you try to do your best. Um, and you afterwards, you think that there was definitely room to improve, just because as a performer, you're always improving with every step you take. But at the same time, you're pretty satisfied just because you know you prepared a lot and you worked really hard for it. So. Um, I guess if you look objectively at the definition of a prodigy, I might fit into that. But I've never really thought of myself as you know, someone really special or really different from everyone else around me. So I don't think I've ever considered myself a prodigy. I think my parents are really proud of me. Um, I'm sure any parent will be proud. But... <laughs> You know, they still want me to push more and push forward, so they're still definitely expecting more from me. My name is Alina Zhang. I'm 14 years old. I'm a freshman and I go to the University of Kansas.